Hey, it's Brian Weber here from the Bartender Journey Podcast. Here's some pictures from my trip to the Patron Hacienda. These pictures were taken in the fields where the agaves are grown, and they are uh, harvested by hand after growing for five years. Here's the entrance to the beautiful Patron Hacienda. It's another picture. Uh, oh, the truck is coming in with a uh, fresh agave on it. This is where they split the agave by hand into four large pieces and it's fed by that conveyor belt there into a brick oven where it cooks for 79 hours believe it or not that's still more and these guys got a, a big a big day ahead of them they got a lot of gave to cut they probably do this every single day like this this is called the tahona and the cooked agaves after they cook for 79 hours are shredded uh, by that tahona there's actually two different processes that go on uh and then they mix them together at the end but uh this shows the tahona process uh, where the agave is uh, the juices are extracted and then sort of forced back into the fibers and uh, this is the other method um, besides the Tahona method. This is the roller method. And uh, so in the end, these two will be distilled and uh, blended together to make the Petron silver. Here is the uh, tanks where there's ferment and then the still copper stills, of course. They're uh, quite small copper pot stills. And uh, the first distillation is a small still and the second, se second distillation is an even smaller still. And this is the uh, Patron. That was the Patron when it came out after distillation. And here's some more pictures of the beautiful Patron Hacienda. They took uh, really great care of us. <laughs> oh, I like that picture of uh, tequila, pipe, tequila pipes. That, that'll be, uh, and so some, uh, the silver Patron's not aged, but the, uh, the there are others that are aged, the uh, Anejo and Re the uh, Reposado and the Anejo, that'll be aged in that Rick house. And, oh, this is the bottling of the Patron. Each one is bottled by hand. Made uh, so many great friends on this trip. I met uh, a bunch of great, great folks. It was 25 bartenders on this trip. And uh, here we are tasting some <laughs> some Patron. And uh, this is outside, uh, outside Patron. And uh, yeah, there's uh, some new friends. There's Summer Jane Bell. The wonderful Summer Jane Bell. I, I uh, interviewed her. She'll, she'll be on a podcast soon. That was a really cool. He was a great bartender. Uh, worked for, working for Patron. These are some little tree hangers that they hung up on this tree. Uh, so everybody who comes on this trip now will uh, be immortalized on that tree. So sun went down. I think I was smoking a Cuban cigar while taking that shot out on the patio. And uh, oh, there's our favorite bartender again. And it was just a great trip more really good friends made on this trip and we're sure to keep in touch over the over the years so uh yeah it was amazing